Hello! Welcome back to, to this. Let's Raid Defenseless Castles, I guess. Has it been a... So a weird thing is... You Crusader King's Viking Edition, because that's what you do when you're Vikings. Yeah. So a weird thing I noticed is you can't really attack, like, monasteries directly. You have to get the castle, but actually, so maybe when I'm just raiding the countryside, I'm raiding monasteries? But in that case, I, I would think I'd get more gold? What, what is this guy? Why does he have a weird turban? He's a member of the Hermetic Society. Okay. What? Nothing, just like... There's just so much random shit in this game that it's hard to... Do you have any... No, you don't have any interesting artifacts being the Hematic Society. Maybe if I get the Finger of St. John, I can, like, flog it for money. Wait, what? What? You think that if you flog it, it just spews out money? No, to flog something for money is to sell it. Especially, like, a pawn shop kind of thing. Shop, you shop? Pawn! Pawn! the figure of St. John in a porn shop? I have he did- oh god! Salvation of Odin! Okay, what does it say? Why else would I not immediately stop conversation which has slowly become the color part? Some of those heretical ideas questioning the salvation of Odin. <laughs> Who the hell is you this You should not speak of this. Yeah, like... I don't want to join the, like, hell worshippers who apparently are a thing. Yeah. We, 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 we don't... No! Not you again! Is that the, the bishop? No, that's the... The guy who's like, oh, no, 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 let me revoke this title. It's like, anybody who talks to us about the salvation of Odin clearly doesn't actually understand Nordic religion, and therefore, we don't need to listen to them. There we are. Yeah, there we go. So how close are we to getting that war chest? Pretty close. Whoa, defeat? Oh yeah, this thing. Yeah, just go ahead. Actually, no! We, we've lost money somehow? Where did money go? Can we try to, like, I don't know, shut that thing down over there just so Oh, that... it, it costs money to have ships raised. Okay. So next time I should raise less ships. Okay. I don't know, that seemed kind of straightforward to me. I mean, that raising ships would cost money. Okay. Well, this has enough loot in it to uh, pay for our war chest. Okay, well, let's do that and then we can. I don't know, have another ambition or something. Yeah. Prosper, okay. Hopefully no one will rise and revolt because that apparently ruins it. Apparently seeing the realm pros having Oh, this new thing has been built. Sternhill Fort Now we're getting fancy, fancy Viking. Yeah, yeah that, that prevents other people from burning our stuff. That's always good. You don't get... What's this? Is this one of our grandsons? You shall also be a fighter. 
Oh my god. Everyone's a fighter! So has our heir had any sons yet? Nope. Is this the Set back! <sighs> Did our carousing friend die? Because he hasn't said anything for ages. We don't have any friends, apparently. And our rival is in prison. That's good, he can stay there. Um, yeah, that guy must have died. I'm gonna put him in the yeah. Wow, you have a lot of children. Wow, all your lads are gonna be divided up badly. That's unfortunate. Okay, what is this? Bad now. Just ran away. That's nice, we always like having extra commanders. Are any of these chieftains not going to be split up? Is there any way to tell? I mean, shouldn't we be able to see who's going to be heir uh, to what? Go. Okay, so these two won't be split up, so let's invest in these. Okay. Because we don't want stuff to, like, be in the things that our not heir gets. Well, specifically, we want to improve the ones we're gonna keep. Yes. Like, maybe if we have leftover gold in prestige. So what do I need to do to embrace feudalism? Oh, hold a great blot. Oh, and our rival is in prison. Yes. Him and one other person. Oh, plus people pay us money to be excused. Oh, you expanded the well even more! You're a madman! Wait, are we are we now connected? Now we're nope. connected! Nope. No, 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 we are. Look. Oh, look. Look. Right there. No, no, but I mean, aren't we connected up here through Cola? Mm, no, no, that, that's a gap. Look. There's not a red dot line, which means we can't cross there. Can't we use our boats? Probably. But they're not raiding anymore. No, I just meant, like, to deal with the peasant revolt, but it's not there. Like, what is he trying to, to like, expand into the Siberian waste? Maybe. That's his manifest destiny. Yeah. Oh, uh, oh, we're sacrificing our rival. Yeah. So apparently, my half-sister was married to him. Yeah, if I... Come to my court. Oh, you don't like me? Why don't you like you me? You just murdered her husband! Oh no! What? She likes this guy, her liege. Who is this guy? Just some person we had in prison that couldn't pay the ransom. You know what happens to people who can't pay their ransom. Yes. You are conversing with another guest with a loud scream of passion interrupt. Okay. Interrupt? With loud screams of passion interrupt. In one corner of the room, in full view of everyone, Porfin is engaging with cardinal pleasures with one of the serving girls. Both are completely naked, and only when they notice the stunned silence in the room do they seem to remember where they are. By the All Father. I don't think Odin Questionable mind. behavior at feast. I don't think Odin cares. Actually, that sounds like the kind of thing that Odin might do. No, that sounds like the kind of thing Zeus would do. Not really Odin that much. No, Odin does that kind of stuff. You're attacking the king of Saxony? Okay. I thought we had a non-aggression pact with Saxony, but what We do! <laughs> I guess? Like we just sit here and it's like, yep, everyone's gonna stab the realm for me. 
what does she want now? Oh, she she's the person who's accusing people of apostasy. Yes. Well, yeah, of course, she's not Norse. Oh no, she's pregnant. Let's just bring out the branding iron. Branded apostate. This character has been accused of apostasy. Whether or not they are, whether or not the claim is any truth is another matter entirely. Who can I imprison? I'm sorry, what? What? Oh, he acted dishonorably towards me. Are you just trying to imprison people for money again? Yeah, I guess I don't need to. What else can I do with money? Search for a smith? What can we do that will make people like us? Weapon smith forged me a deadly weapon and I'm in need of a new set of armor. Finally, the farmest armor smith. Find me a goldsmith to cast through befitting my status. Well, I already have a weapon. So should we get armor or jewels? Armor. Because then our son will have them, and that will make him more martially awesome. So you said a weaponsmith? No, training grounds. We should also probably give him another concubine, because he's just not doing well. Okay, more present debutante. Of course, this could explain why she doesn't like us. Oh, a lustful! Yes, that'll make a great concubine. There she is. But you're giving that to our son, right? Yes. yes. Invited to take part in a war game. Yay. The best warlords win. At the beginning of the war game, your enemy decides to do a strong frontal assault towards your center flank. Use all means to reinforce and strengthen the center or slowly withdraw the forces in the center. Oh, I know this! Slowly withdraw forces from the center. Oh? This is some Hannibal shit. Yeah, okay. This is what he does. Odin decides to hold his line when our troops withdraw from the center flank. Podir suggests that we charge the enemy while the enemy... Charge the center while the enemy hesitates. Per our large push on the le our left flank. With support from the center, use our center troops as reserve for now for our now pressured side flanks. Prepare a counterattack in the center flank. I mean, my instinct would be to counterattack from the center, but I get the feeling that I would make a shit commander. So, well, let's see what happens. My marshals told me about a remarkable armor smith for Vardian Vared. He suggests that I invite the man to my court and seek his work for myself. If he manages to impress me, I could have my own, order my own custom-made item. Uh, let's just hope that the marshal Our own have... smiths are capable enough, or invite the armor smith. You think the marshal could do a better job fighting this armor smith than the steward? Well, here he is, port bra the, uh, the armor smith. He'd make a really good steward. Hmm. Let's invite him. We launch our attack and manage to break the opponent's center, giving us the opportunity to subdue their split forces with ease. We stand uncontested. More prestige. Why do we keep being defeated? What? We won. Oh, I thought that said defeat. Once Marshal Putter has assumed that the armor Swiss craftsmanship has left nothing to decide, I receive the him in the throne room. He introduced himself as Master... 
how, how do you? That's a thun, right? That we had P. Master Thorbrandir. That's a th thun, whatever it is. Thorn, yes. Thorbrandir. Thorbrandir. And gestures towards his numerous assistants who all carried examples of his work. Does man prefer anything special in mind? I'm in need of protection. Make me a strong set, strong and sturdy set of armor. Also, be my steward. Yes. Be my guest. Be my steward, be my steward, because all the others are so skewered. <laughs> yeah. While you're making the armor, you can search for the <laughs> artifact. <laughs> A set of armor, I see. Excellent choice. Uh, I have three examples of different quality levels here. One must determine what one needs and how much one is willing to pay, however, they will also... I will not go into battle with anything but the best. That costs 4,000. This option is available due to high prestige. I do not need any frills. Cost me something effective. I'm sure whatever you make is good enough, Master. Uh, let's go for the best. Yeah. And so it's 1822, so it's probably going to be like a set of full plate armor. During the afternoon, as I went to check the progress of Master Pro, I walked into the scene getting my grandson Guma to help with the forging process. Together they were lifting pieces of metal. So, oh, okay. What's good, on? So he's doing something that's like beneath him. But if I let him do it, I lose prestige, but he gains the brawny trait. Yeah, no, I like that idea. I've been worried about Stuart's Proto's progress, or rather lack of. On the artifact? Yeah. As a consequence of Proto's carelessness, an accident has occurred. What? Already? You screwed up already! I was like, wait, you're worried about his progress? He's been on the job for like two days, the other guy was on it for like ten years and made no progress and you were fine with it. Yeah. Probably just check periodically to make sure there are no plots to kill us. Uh, apparently I can go into hiding so there might be. Well, better check up on that well, then. my grandson died of dysentery? Was this the one that was becoming no, brawny? No, no. Okay. Compose a book. Oh, you have to have a learning of eight. That might be fun. Yeah. Plots, plots. What's that plot? It's got some people in it. Yeah. What's the- what is it? Stop what- it- kill me! Ah, I suspected it. Wait, is that her again? Jesus Christ- okay, um... Imprisoned? Rebellion- oh no, I shouldn't have done that. Oh, people are trying to kill us. Uh, you're not going to raise troops? The vassal is arguing with his wife. She seems quite upset. They all were screaming at each other. They don't even notice you were watching them. Wait, isn't he the one that was having sex during the plot? Maybe. Should I intervene or it's none of my business? Sure, why don't we intervene? was upset that I intervened. Okay. Well, somebody else doesn't like us. Uh, we're hosting a dinner for some local dignities where a full moon comes into full view of one of the windows. Trembling, you excuse yourself and hurry up the stairs to your bedchamber while stripping off your clothes. You are completely naked when the guards find you crouched on your balcony howling for the moon. Yeah, I knew this was going to happen. Lose 20 prestige, why? As soon as it said full moon, I'm like, oh, he's gonna go into werewolf mode. 
What? She has another county? Oh no, somebody else joined the war. The drunkard. I was struck with nervous excitement when Master Poor Dan would announce that the new set of armor. Oh, we're almost out of time, let me finish reading this. Today I've received the Master in my throne room. As he unveils the armor rack, I'm almost impossible to breathe. What will you name her, my Emperor? This armor shall be my guardian. With this armor, I shall be a champion. Everyone shall fear the warden. Okay. Champion? What? What is this? Vanished without a trace? Back to incompetence, steward. Alright, we're out of time. Oh yeah, bye!